Welcome to Moo Math and Science and Hybridization and Inbreeding. Farmers, animal breeders, gardeners, and scientists have used hybridization for years to produce new and sometimes superior offspring. So what is hybridization? It's when you cross two parent organisms with different forms of a trait to produce offspring with a specific trait, and it's also called a hybrid. For example, a farmer may want to cross a type of tomato that is disease resistant with a type of tomato that grows quickly. This in order to produce a tomato that grows quickly and is also disease resistant. Sounds great in theory, but it can be very challenging and expensive to do this in real life. It took three decades for rice breeders to produce a hybrid rice that produces higher yields than a non-hybrid rice. Once a breeder observes a desired trait in an organism, a process is needed to ensure this trait is passed on to future generations. This process in which two closely related organisms are bred to have desired traits and eliminate undesired traits is called inbreeding. Examples include the Clydesdale horse, Angus cattle, and German shepherds. Horse breeders in Scotland first bred Clydesdale hundreds of years ago for use as a farm horse. Because of their strong build, agility, and good nature, Clydesdale were inbred to preserve these traits. However, a disadvantage of inbreeding is that harmful recessive traits can be passed on to future generations because it increases the chance of a homozygous recessive offspring when both parents carry the recessive allele, and then the harmful trait will not be eliminated. Thanks for watching, and remember, Kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today.